Hi, my name is Steve Burton. I am one of the lead criminal defense attorneys at Intermountain Legal. And we just got done speaking about the process for criminal cases in Utah. I want to go into a little bit more detail about one of the stages, which is called a preliminary hearing, and answer the question, what is a preliminary hearing? Uh, a preliminary hearing is kind of like a abbreviated trial. Uh, it's not a full-blown trial. They don't, the, the other side, the prosecution, does not have to present all of their evidence. However, is, it is an opportunity for them to present their evidence to the court to show that they have enough evidence to go forward. Now, the process for felony cases and Class A misdemeanors is very long. And so if there is no evidence in a case, we don't want somebody to have to endure that long process. So the preliminary hearing is a chance for the prosecutor to show the judge that they have enough evidence to go forward. The judge then will make the decision whether or not to bind the case over for trial. Now most of the time, if they've filed charges, it means that they do have some evidence and usually enough evidence to go forward to trial. So the purpose of the preliminary hearing is often for the defense to see how strong the case really is against them and to decide what strategies may work best in order to uh, prepare a defense for the final trial. Also, it's an opportunity for the prosecution to see if there are holes in their case. And if there are, then oftentimes a preliminary hearing will lead to uh, a negotiated result, some kind of plea bargain, or sometimes even a dismissal.